What's up, my favorite people? What's up, Michigan? What's up, Dave Matt? Love you, brother. He's always driving through a cornfield most of the time. <laughs> oh, man. How you guys doing this beautiful day? Beautiful day here in Michigan. If my bike was running, I wasn't going to work tonight. Yep, that beautiful day. 70 sunny out. Beautiful. Uh, Remote and I and a few other devil dogs, a few other Monty, Hawk, a few other guys, uh, Tom, uh, Chuck C. We were all talking last night. And uh, we all come up with a pretty good idea. We need to get a list together. And I think it needs to be um, so we, we can all help each other out with certain things um i think how it came up was uh, uh i think they're gonna start taking uh well there's gonna be a shortage of of goods and i think some of that's gonna be on purpose like uh vitamins uh, you can already see it i don't know so much about vitamins yet but first aid kits not too many of them on the shelf at least the day i went now, there could be some there now. I, I don't know. Um, but I'm not I'm not real smart with certain things. And we can all help each other out. <clears throat> um, like, I didn't know if I just take zinc, it really is not going to matter. You need to take vitamin A with it, too. So here I would have been full of zinc, and then, then nothing's happening. I guess you need vitamin A with it. So those are the little things I'm talking about that, that I don't know about. So, I think we all got to, um, we're all kind of stocked up, but today let's just try to make a list together. Uh, go get a pen and paper. That's what I'm going to do. And I'm going to write down the things that I'm missing. If something, I'm not going to make a whole list. If somebody brings something up that I need, then I'm going a, I'm to, a, basically I'm going to break it down in maybe three or four groups. Like food, we can talk about that, we can talk about uh, vitamins. Um, vitamins, health kind of thing, um, survival. I think those would probably be the three main things. Uh, you know, that way if something does happen, we're comfortable. Uh, I like to be comfortable. Most of us like to be uncomfortable. That's why we're in the position we're in, right? We didn't, we didn't do anything to get uncomfortable. Um, and it might not ever happen. You know, we might not, the internet might not go down the, uh, it might just be a smooth transition. Well, you still kind of need to stock up on vitamin D anyway, I believe, uh, vitamins anyway. That, that keeps you out of the, out of the, uh, the uh, gas chamber. So that's what I'm going to start calling hospitals, gas chambers, because that's what they are, modern day gas chambers. Uh I don't know if YouTube's going to like that or not. That's too bad. That's what they are. We'll go back to Jeff Riddle 1 or already got Jeff Riddle 3. Whatever. Don't matter. Um, so that's what I want to talk about today. Not necessarily what we will talk about. We can talk about something totally different the whole time. Um, And, and I think we need to stock up on this stuff pretty quick because I think uh, the sun's kind of, I mean, yeah, the sun's out today, but it's not going to be every day up here in the north. And uh, if you're above the 35th parallel, you need to uh, uh, supplement vitamin D. So I think you're going to start seeing a lot of people that are sick and they're going to blame it on cold and flu. But it's never cold and flu season. It's never that. It's always lack of something, lack of vitamin D season. My opinion, I'm not a doctor. You get sick because you're, you're lacking something. <clears throat> I told you that story about my mom. Always gets a, a, a sinus infection, like January. It's almost You can almost set a clock to it. And I said, hey, mom, you need to start taking some vitamin D. Um, you know, well, last year she took it and she never had a sinus infection. So it does work. Um, me and my wife, 
she don't like taking medicine. I don't mind it. I don't like the taste of it. I don't like the taste of this stuff. But that don't matter. I'd rather suffer a tiny, tiny bit than suffer because I'm a wimp. Now, the man, the, the man flu will kill a woman. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? The man flu is going to kill a woman. That's how bad it is. It's just different for us. I don't know what it is. Um, I got to tell you a true story. Well, that's kind of true. I'm kind of messing with you a little bit. But uh, when we meet new people, Michelle jumps on my back real quick. And then uh, people ask, well, what's, what's on your back? I said, oh, that's Michelle. Like that one, Craig? You can't use it because your wife's name is not Michelle. So you can't steal that one. All right, put the codes in. My shell. It's a funny one. You got to be paying attention, though, when I talk. That's why I throw those little things in there. See if you're paying attention to me. If you don't laugh, I'll say it again. Or if you act like you don't hear me, I'm going to say it again. Yeah, it's going to get awkward. Yeah. All right, there. Computer locked up for a second. All right. All right, cool. There's the there's the numbers. If you're, I know a lot of people have a hard time getting on it uh, with Zoom. Uh, see, I don't really give you the whole story, right? So we got to download Zoom, which I don't know how to do that on a, on a uh, computer or a laptop. I don't know how to do that. But the first big number is the meeting number. So you type that in. Well, uh, first, I think you'll, you'll click join group or join new meeting or join meeting, I think. And then you'll put that big long number in there. That's the meeting ID number. And then <clears throat> you click on that, join or continue. And then the six digit number is the passcode. Now, if you're on a phone, it is kind of hard. You got to swipe. I think you got to swipe screens or something. I don't know. Shep, what's going on? I'm just hanging out in the wind. Oh, it looks like a beautiful day up there in PNW. James just finished. Uh, I don't know if you can see it, but he just finished all the uh, blowing of the lawn. And he said, how long do you think it's going to take to get back to where it was? Yeah. Oh, maybe one day. Yeah. <laughs> We were up north doing the roof. We got a bunch of pine trees up there. Michelle raked the front yard. Within an hour, it was already covered again. Diamond, what's going on, young lady? Hey, not much, Jeff. How about you? Good. I slept in today. Good. Yeah. Did you see our tribute to you? No, I just woke up like 3.30. Oh. I, didn't, I, didn't, <laughs> I didn't see it. I'm sure it was good, though. I, I will go back and watch it. You'll love it. It's on Craig's channel. Sure, it's going to be good. <laughs> what I would like to know is, I would like to know uh, was that he did a little bit later after that with the high pitched voice. Oh yeah, like a virgin. Did you guys hear that? Yeah, see it. Yeah, Shepherd beat us this time. <laughs> yeah, you guys I, must have been over. On I sure did. I was on it. <laughs> I told him, uh, LOL, I said, do not quit your day job. Uh, Greg started singing again, did he? He did. He did a video oh. of uh, Like a Virgin. <laughs> um, Shep, hey, Shep can remember. Um, I don't know if anyone else will, but uh, when we first started, it was Craig and I, just Craig and I for a while, and uh, he would start singing. <laughs> and... Uh, People would actually, you could look right at the numbers in, in real time and they'd just be diving. <laughs> you can't be doing that anymore, that's, so we stop. That's what happens. I can't that's why they do that on that's why they do that on my show. He starts yeah, singing and they Mom. dive. That's it. Gosh, darn it. <laughs> yeah. I think he did it on Liberty once and Liberty's like, oh no, you, you gotta stop that stuff. Yeah, don't, don't yeah, no singing. You can't do that. <laughs> but maybe we'll do it on today. With, with How you guys? Man. But Craig get some you get some wrong size underwear, one size too small or something. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see the video? I didn't, but I'm gonna check it out now. It sounds funny. 
Oh, I guess the helmet on just in case if uh, Mr. T uh, swings the golf balls out of his head. <laughs> hey, uh, Craig, could you do an encore with uh, uh, Opera Man for us today, sir? No. No. <laughs> Opera Man. Oh, Opera now. Man. now I I'm trying to think if I can remember the words. Craig can't do it. No one can. All right, here's what. I, here's all I can remember. Um. Oh, so good. Oh, no, no. Joey just to shit himself and he <laughs> no speaker right. Listen, fat, here's the deal. You're a dog pony soldier boy. He say he going to save me, but he work for a CCP. A foul she and gay she, I definitely want to kill a bee. They say I no live right, me eating pasta every night. That's, that's probably all I remember. That's really good. <laughs> what the? Yeah, sorry. The good old days, Craig. <laughs> the good old days. <laughs> That's so nice that we have good old days now. <laughs> yeah, you're right. I, I had something to for you to add to your list of, of things to get. Bazooka. Bazooka <laughs> bubblegum. Remember that? <laughs> yeah. I love bazooka bubblegum. <laughs> you could always read the little cartoon. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> yeah. You ready? Yeah. Potassium iodide. Tablets, iodide, not iodine, iodide. Your start water, purifi water purification. We're going to start off with a word I can't even spell. This is awesome. <laughs> I, I, oh, yeah, okay. P O T A S S I U M. Yes. yes. It don't matter. I, I, know, I know what I wrote down, so it's all right. O D Al I D E. <laughs> Iodide. Yeah, that, one, that one's all right. I think I That's, got that one. That sounds Italian. Italian. There's a difference. Iodide. There's a iodide. difference between iodide. the iodide and iodine. Hey. Iodide. Iodide. <laughs> iodide. Okay. What those are? The other day. It's the treat for for uh, radiation poisoning. You put it's it on good. a piece of pie. Iodide. Iodide. Yeah. Iodide. Yes. Iodide. You put it on a piece of pie. Not the red stuff. No. So no. I would have, I'd have, I'd have got the wrong stuff. I'd have died. No, that's why I said it's important. <laughs> and that's the yeah. treat. I have potassium some iodides. That's that. used uh, for radiation poisoning, correct? Yeah. Yeah, it's important to have in any kind of home in case, you know, we do survive through a nuclear blast, you know. Get you some dynamo, not dynamite, uh, dynamo. Uh, dynamo. 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 Similar. Dynamos? Yeah. <laughs> Dominoes? You see uh, Air Force One was leaving for Pennsylvania. I don't watch TV, uh, uh, <coughs> Robert. I wonder who was on there. I don't care. I don't watch it. Chuck Did season. anybody see the newest on the volcanoes erupting? <laughs> I started to watch it. I watched the video where the Japan one blew its top. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The, it reminded me of Mount St. Helens. The supersonic blast at the other one. That's what it looked like, exactly like that. One oh, of yeah. the events at the below was like exploding outwardly, and then the uh, top vent was just spewing this lava. And I found out that it's just been going on for what, 32 days now or, or longer? And the reason why it's been going on for so long <laughs> Is is because there's no more virgins to throw in. Oh, Lord. Hey Jeff, did you tell your wife that? Uh, <laughs> That's true. Uh, That's true. They've all been gotten to. Remote, say yeah. a prayer real quick for the virgins. For the I virgins. think we need. I think we need prayer for the virgins. Need more. Hey. I love that. Oh, I got you guys. <laughs> the, the Middle <laughs> Eastern <stumped>. guys. <laughs> the Middle Eastern guys has all screwed then because you know when they. <laughs> It's a paradise. Again, the paradise. Yeah. They're, they're waiting to go, they're waiting they to go up there. They all up. That's yeah. why the volcano is so mad. They're, Wait, they're waiting Lil to go has up a there. Virgin. They're waiting to go to, to go to Allah and and meet the seventy two virgins. <laughs> oh jeez. Go yep. ahead, Diamond. 
I was just going to ask a question. I've been divorced for over 13 years. Do I revert back to being a virgin? Absolutely. Yep. Okay. Like Craig saying earlier, I might go. I might go throw myself into one of those volcanoes for all of mankind. How about that? No, we need you. You're too important. We'll send some useless virgin. Diamond. You're gonna have to take one for the team, Diamond. Diamond, we can't have you going in there. Why does why, why does that remind me of the Tom Hanks and the and that one? Film. Joe in the volcano. Joe in the volcano. <laughs> Please don't splash oh, in the pool. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Chuck C's here, y'all. Everybody, please, can we welcome Chuck C to the house? Hey, Chuck. Welcome, hey, Chuck. Hey, welcome to the house. <laughs> Get my wife calling during the show. Doesn't so she know funny. we're doing a show right Put now? Put her on live. Put her on live. All right, let me call her back. Hey, Jeffrey. Your son? Uh, Go ahead, go ahead, Monty, before I call back and get yelled at for calling her on live. I get yelled at anyways, Craig. What is the one with on the back of Michelle? That's Michelle. I ain't yeah. going to work with her. Who's that on your back? That's, my oh, that's Michelle. <laughs> yep. Tell your, wife, tell your wife to go have a news conference here shortly. Hey, honey. Hey, what's going on? Oh, we're just talking about you live on air right now. Hi. Hey. Everybody's listening Hi. to you. Hi, are all honey. live on air. I can't hear you. Oh, they're all live on air right now. Everybody's listening to you? Yeah. Oh. Hi. Hi, honey. All right. Diamond said hi, honey. Hi. Hello, hi. honey from East Texas. And that's hi, Chuck. Honey. All right. Love you. <laughs> hi, none your business. Well, she did not sound happy. Uh, she's yeah yeah we got we got you uh, in deep water there buddy sorry That's what happens when you got to work all day at the hospital she you might have called have for a for a talk dirty session with you uh, and you put her on yeah, the spot and I messed it all up <laughs> chuck that happens in the dream world a long long time ago. no afternoon delight for you craig <laughs> Mm. You have sex for me and my wife anymore is when we walk by each other in the hallway and say, fuck off. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> That's oral sex. <laughs> it's quick. Yep. <laughs> oh, Goob's here too. What up, Goob? Uh, hello. <coughs> hey, Goob. Hello. So, did you guys hear about the uh, Netflix uh, protest outside of Netflix this morning? Yeah, they were. They don't like the <laughs> Chappelle show. They're uh, they're they're pissed off that Dave Chappelle is funny and make jokes about the LGB. So the <laughs> LGBT community cannot take jokes, y'all. Please stop joking right. with them. They but cannot what's take jokes. Even funnier is that they were saying all the employees are leaving Netflix. They're walking out. Well, three employees. Okay. Left. Oh, <laughs> oh, are you kidding me, Shep? So it was BS. And everybody outside was mostly the press. Oh, wow. So, Imagine that crap. media lying. Yeah. All right, bye-bye. <laughs> well, and they said the owner caved in to it. Somebody in the chat said, uh, Mr. T slash Chappelle 2024. <laughs> <laughs> it's so bad. Did they call him a racist for not believing in the alphabet? <laughs> Probably. Probably. <laughs> Um, well, that's all the has his hand I have today. Over. Monty, go ahead, buddy. How about all those firefighters that returned their boots, or the state troopers that uh, returned their hats and their and their shoes? Yeah, it's happening. It, it's happening, but like Ramon and I were talking last night, that this is not really good. That everyone, I mean, it's a it's a double edged sword, right? Everyone's quitting, which they should. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna not quit, but I'm gonna get fired if they want to mandate this bullshit. But that's, the, this is the guys where they bring in their own yahoos because there's no doctors, there's no nurses, there's no firefighters, there's no cops. We got to bring our own people in just to, just so we can keep America running. And then that's, that's what's gonna happen, in my opinion. Yeah. They gotta do something. Well, the the beauty of that, Jeff, is is you'll know who the enemy is. Yeah. You guys all heard about all the states donating National Guard to Texas to put them down on the border, huh? No, but been, need, been needing that for a while. And I'm, yeah. I, I, I still can't figure out Texas as governor. Is he, 
I, he really he is. He does wishing. stuff to try to appease people. I think is all he's doing is like, okay, they're pushing me. I, okay, I'll show him a little face. I agree. Yeah. Go ahead, Diamond. I saw on the Gateway Pundit that, and on my local papers that here in Maine, over 2,000 uh, healthcare workers uh, put in a, an appeal to the Supreme Court because they're mandated to get the doodle by, I think, it's the 29th of this month. And Justice Stephen Breyer denied their appeal and told them to, you know, figure it out with the state uh, courts and appeals. So he denied their emergency request for an appeal. Justice Breyer must have been bushed. Craig, what's the number now? Uh, what number are you looking for? He said 77 was the last. Yeah, Barr and uh, Miley were just busy, LGBTQ and. Uh oh. Hey, Jeff with a G. What's up, my brother? Jeff with a G. Jeff with a G. Yeah. G off. 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 That's how his G father off. used to call it. Probably Joffrey. Pretty. That's how they like to spell it over there. Joffrey. Oh, wait. Where, like is he from, where is he located? Uh, I don't know. He's probably over there, though. That's how he's thrown. That's how he spelled it over there. Over there. Over yonder. Over yonder. Over yonder. <laughs> Are we at eighty percent yet, Jeff or uh, Craig? Oh, that number! You see, you had me so, Robert. You got to put some context with it. I, I, oh, it was Craig. I mean, Craig. I thought I was silly. Yes, ma'am. Oh, well, Monty's got to stand questions. up again. Go ahead, Monty. That's just like school. I need a nap. <laughs> Before it slips my mind, I just want to. I just want to discuss slips. this little thing. So. I, I shared a video to Hawk. He played it. And so it was showing the high base, you know, this vehicle and the window and the door distorting and waving. It was, yes. Guess what? Guess what? What? This is how stupid YouTube is. That's base. It's, that's a subwoofer, right? I got a copyright claim up on it for violent base extortion. Are it, it, you yeah. kidding me? Yeah. And you know who the, you know who the, the claimant is? No Frog. one, oh. no one. There's no name on it. Of all what? the four copyright claims I got, there was no name on that. <laughs> I'm like, that's YouTube, wild. You can, you can take that claim and stick it right up your, you know. You mean yeah, subwoofer? <laughs> yeah. yeah, you got subwoofer, buddy. Tell them to put it in their prison wallet. Yeah, yeah. exactly. <laughs> a dazzle, a diamond lil. That's what uh, Tracy Q said. I've already risked my life once for you guys already. <laughs> yeah, you really have, Don. We've been putting you out, of, out on the ringer with a bear attack. But, Joff but, is from SoCal, by the way. Jo Joff, SoCal. Uh, G off. But, G -off. Hey, G off. G -off. <clears throat> but I also want to add, but when I, at the time this morning when I checked that, it was still 9 o'clock before I went to bed, my time. I want to appreciate everybody for the 800 and some views of that video, though. <laughs> I was I watching greatly, this morning. I every greatly appreciate I, it. Every time I pop on, like, they're still on. It's crazy. Yeah, he's wondering why he's getting... In the morning. I was watching from 4 o'clock in the morning. He was watch, he's wondering why he's getting so many views. It, it was a seven-hour stream. <laughs> I mean, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and was I was three stream. hours behind you, and I, I couldn't stay up. <laughs> I just... I'll see you in the morning. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Jeff, you were there, right? When I yeah. left. Yeah, we know who the night owls are, that's for sure. We've yeah, discovered well, them. after tonight, you won't see me for... Well, probably. you're by design. Monty's well, doing that uh, stuff for that free. Late. Well, yeah. we're going to miss you, right? You yeah. know that, right? <laughs> oh, yeah. I mean, I, I might get on here at four, but I won't be late. Because at work, I ain't got nothing to do. You know? Mm -hmm. so yeah. it's, it's really nice. For, for now. Are you going anywhere, Jeff? I got a funeral uh, Friday that uh, oh. my grandma's ex-boyfriend died that oh, night. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, so I, I I think it was Friday. I didn't get a chance to talk to the wife this morning, but I do think it's tomorrow or Friday. I don't know what day it is. Today's Wednesday, Thursday. Yeah, Friday. Mm -hmm. 
So that means I can't stay up anymore. I got to go back to my daytime routine. So can anybody explain what Ever Brand is? Is it a company? Is a company? (laughs) That's the company, from what I understand, right? Yeah, Evergreen ships from containers fall under that. Under that, yeah. Well, Evergrande is a big company that's Evergrande. Yeah, yeah. It's like a great big. uh, Oh, what's the fancy word for that? Where they where they uh, deal in loans and everything else. A hedge fund. Uh, And businesses. Oh, okay. But that makes sense then because somebody's in chat said that it was going to collapse on the 23rd, which would make sense. Their loan. Right? Because they're going to default. Yeah. That's going to domino affect a lot of others. Yeah. Is that the Chinese company? They've been talking about that. Mm -hmm. Yes. And who's buying buying up the stocks? BlackRock. It's almost like they know what's going on. Yeah. Almost. They're in on it. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) <laughs> Evergrande is also involved probably with the ship, the cargo ships mm-hmm. that's sitting out in the harbor. Red Pillin says the Evergrande Group or the Evergrande Real Estate Group is the second largest property developer in China by sales. It's ranked 122nd on the Fortune Globe. Wow. It, so it's kind of like Fannie Mae and Fannie Mac. I you want to hear, hear something on a scary level? How Absolutely. many of them containers on the tops of those container ships are weaponized? Sure. Oh. Yes, Club K. Yeah. If you guys haven't seen that, I'll post some. The one with the shipping con- the shipping container itself opens up with the missile that comes out, yep. right? Yes. Yeah. Uh, there's missiles and other types of... Uh, of uh, bad things. Let's we got to be that. careful showing it though, because um, they might go after us on that one. I actually saw those uh, on some video a long time ago. They were in the back parking lot of a Costco. Here. <laughs> and Chabal did some stuff on it. That's why I know he got taken for it. So we got to watch oh. him. Uh, I got some containers here in front of a Target, not too far from me. Yeah. You look at it too, and we got four or five hundred ships out there floating around in the top layer of them that could leave up there like 800 on each one that could be that way so that's scary yeah, it is. and it's just not like that on the pacific coast either it's like that on the atlantic coast just yep. a reminder in the harbors they, and bays they can reach anywhere go ahead diamond uh, i just googled evergrand company and what they own and it says they own two major theme park brands Hanga, Children of the World, and Hanga, H-E-N-G-D-A, Water World. So that's Probably scary. like one of their little anime thing. That is scary. Oh, yeah. We most likely going to kill you. <laughs> it's uh, their version of Disney World and Disneyland. Right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. We're going to get your kids. And, and you look at that anime, that goes real <clears throat> deep into the filth, too. All of yeah. them. Oh, yeah. I know. What are they trying to do to us, Craig? <laughs> trying to kill us. Jeffrey. <laughs> 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 he's ready. Look at him. He's got his helmet. <laughs> and he's done his lashes already. He's just got to get on his, uh, his rouge. <laughs> Craig, Craig come on here a while ago. I think it was me and him again. And- he was all upset about something. I said, look, man, just relax. So they're all trying to kill us. And he just started laughing. <laughs> I mean, you got to laugh at the truth hurts. We're going to be just gonna say that. a joyful tear as we go into the, the depths of hell. <laughs> Don't worry. Don't worry about all this other stuff. Either they have it in control. God, God's always got it in control, so it's no big deal. Let's just have fun until the end. Who gives a crap? Yeah. We can't really control it for the most part. We can control the little things on the local level, on the you know everyday life that you deal with. We can control that, but we can't control the big picture. We're not we're not there. We're we're, we're it's way above our head. So let's just pray about it and, and have fun. That's all we got to do. Absolutely. You know. You can't Craig, do anything with what's out of your pay grade. Right. Craig, I got some good news for you though, buddy. 
Oh, please tell me, Monty. <laughs> Adder Wonky's going to have that shipment in Friday with some clip-on earrings for you. Dude, the news just got better. <laughs> this is going to help me get into women's sports, Jeff. I don't know if you know how to use it. But the bad thing, Craig, is you're still going to come in third place. You're probably right. This I thought it was going to no. be an advantage, but it might be a disadvantage. You're still going to get beat by the women. I'm going to do events, too, that are predominantly women are better at. And they but, literally will beat him. You know, yeah. you might like that I, kind of. Thing. I am looking forward to Chuck C is right. Yes, <laughs> you ever, you guys ever seen Ringer with uh, uh yeah. the Ringer with uh, what's his, what's his face from Jackass, Johnny Knoxville? Uh-huh. <laughs> yes, 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 yep, yeah. So I thought you were special, <laughs> <laughs> Greg. So dip you in honey and throw you to the lesbians, huh? Hey. You know what? Chuck may have found an in for me. Good grief, Chuck. You're right. I look more like a lesbian than I do a woman. That's the route I got to go. That is true, Craig. Yes. I need to be more bushy. You identify as a lesbian, Craig? You know, uh, yeah. Pretty much so. No, you know what you need to do, though? See, we're going way down this. We're going down the wrong way. But listen, I use secret deodorant. If that's anything, we're already there, you know. So let's just keep on going. Yeah, let's just keep on going. Oh shoot! You need to change your name to like Terry or Pat or Chris. You know, you're right. On a, you don't right. know what it, you don't right. know what which one is. Which, you don't know. Yeah. yeah, you're right. That's what you need to do. You're right about people that. guessing. You're right, Christine. Cody. <laughs> Sid. Sydney could be a girl or a boy. Yeah. Aaron. Yes. Yeah. Aaron. Jeff. I could do Sydney. Or GF. <gasps> Joff. It's a man. GF. That was already said. T- Why are you going to say Joff? Spell with a G. It's Jeff with a J is more girly. Jeff with a J is more manly. <laughs> yeah. GF with a G is more feminine. About- <laughs> Not if I thought so. I would think <laughs> with a G is more <laughs> manly. I dated a Jamie once and she was gorgeous. <sighs> Jamie's, Jamie's a great one. Yeah, Jamie's, Jamie's a good crying. one. You, you got to do a remote. <coughs> Robin. I did it a hairy girl one time. <laughs> so, so this one time, and not at band camp, uh, I was I was sitting down amongst this group of people, and when he's passing around a pipe, and so she, her name was Jamie, and I'm like, okay, she goes. We probably met a long time ago, but my name was Jeremy. And I'm like, hi. Uh oh. <laughs> probably so. <laughs> wow, chicka, wow, wow. Hey, did uh did that girl look like she had buckwheat in a headlock? No. Did you say hey Mark? Greg. Oh oh yeah, the, the hairy girl? Yeah. Oh like yeah, yeah. Buckwheat dude, in totally. a headlock. Oh, every everywhere. Even the legs. She was European. And she smelled to patchouli. <laughs> wow. What? To keep you warm in the winter, though, Craig. You got you got to weigh things off. Did you, you know? say patchouli? Patchouli oil, yeah. Yes, oh, patchouli oh oil. <laughs> yeah, I used to okay, love Okay, exp- <laughs> I, I, I've never heard of that. What is it? Oh, it's, oh, gosh. It's like. The bohemians, the hippies always used it. For, yeah, it uh, covers every okay, scent in the world. Run. I got fish, oh, dead fish, that's why they always smell like that. Hot, they yeah, all they smell were. the same. Yeah, that was right. <laughs> that was that stuff. Oh, yeah. see, I learned something today. I feel better. Yep. Yep. So, uh, I, I can't explain the curry smell in foreigners, though. I don't know what that comes from. They have some sort of smell. Curry. I guess that's what it is. I got a funny story real quick. We were in Florida. We were looking for, uh, we just bought the house. We were looking for a, uh, a bedroom outfit, stuff like that. So we just happened to pass this this uh, yard sale. Well, it was a house sale. And uh, we go in and it smelled like curry. And, uh, guy told us his whole story look my wife left me then i, I was moving and i dropped something on my toe i cut my toe off <laughs> and uh we go in the house smells like curry so we called that he was from trinidad so we call that this bedroom outfit i got right in front of me it's called the trinidad outfit <laughs> <laughs> i'll go to the back bedroom well which one the trinidad bedroom or the other bedroom? <laughs> oh the trinidad bedroom all right I know, which, I know where to go now <laughs> that was great it reminds me of my honeymoon suite that we didn't make a reservation for. We were kids and we went to Disneyland for our honeymoon. 
and James was in charge of making the reservations, so he didn't make any. <laughs> we had uh, in some motel. It was Indian, uh, East Indian family that ran it. And he said, oh, come back to the back room into the honeymoon suite, which was behind the office. I guess it was their regular residence area. They lived oh upstairs God. and the garlic <laughs> coming through the walls. <laughs> I'll never forget it. Yeah, that was great. <laughs> the the turmeric in the in the curry, yeah, it, is strong smelling when they make make their dinners and real oh. and other spices. We were in college. The dude across the hall, his roommate was from over there, and the more one the first morning, his alarm went off, and the dude hit the deck, jumped out. He thought it was an air siren. <laughs> <laughs> the room stunk. And uh, he was getting, he's like, dude, it's, I, you know, they got that smell. That's, you know, that smell. The whole room smells of that smell. He just kept telling me that. But Nelly, will you please stop? We're in a live show. That's reminding say- me of a song. Um, ooh, that smell. Yeah. That's Skinner. 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 <laughs> Skinner. There you go. Drugs and alcohol, yeah. The smell that surrounds you. Yeah, Can you smell that smell? Whiskey bottles, brand new cars. Great yeah. song. They all go together. I have uh, that album with the fire on the cover, and then they yeah, die. I had that when yes. I was a kid. And that was I one of the that. guys who caught on fire, Artemis, whatever. He was the dude on fire in, on the cover. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And he actually died that way? Well, he caught on the fire. Yeah. In the- yeah. I saw a video yesterday. Uh, it was a TikTok video um, that was up there, and it didn't say the hotel, but. The woman was sitting there, her and her daughter, I guess, and they re- noticed uh, like a little bit of a uh, lift in the carpet. So they kind of pulled the carpet back and there was like a trap door Ooh. and they opened it up and there was like mm-hmm. a crawl space underneath there. And it went to like a, uh, you know, another ho- uh, motel room. Oh. And so they called the office and they said, what's going on with that? And they, and of course, she said that uh, they said that the uh, people at the front desk said that, uh, uh, first of all, it was nothing. And then she said it was for pipes. But the woman said, there's no pipes under there. It was all like woods that you could, you know, you could actually get somebody could go down in there and, you know, crawl. Come up while to you're the sleeping. Other room. Yeah. Yeah. So they just, they, she said they gained, they, you know, they got an attitude with it. It didn't say what hotel, though. Interesting. Yeah, no kidding. You got to go down the hole. Yep. Yeah. You can't just wonder what's down there. You got to go down there and she, find out she, what's down there. Yeah, well, she put her camera mm-hmm. down in with and your it camera. showed that it went. With that the it went. Yeah, well, she didn't go in it, but she put her camera down to show that it went, you know, quite a, quite a distance. Wow. It was weird. I'd have sent the wife down there and then I'd have been like, look, I'll be up here, I'll protect the hole for you. You go that way, I'll I'll sit here and make sure no one comes after you. You would have sent Michelle down there. <laughs> what is Robert watching? Robert, what are you watching? Ladies first, I'm yeah, well, yes, but I don't think I'm gonna get I'm gonna put some money on it that Michelle would not have gone in. She would have said, you go first and I'll follow you. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Hey, yeah you go in the hole, you a-hole. Yeah, like, you, go- Look, <laughs> you go first and then I'll follow you. I'll be like, no, you got to stay up here. Make sure you don't <laughs> open the door. No, I'm going to follow you. I'll be like, Look, we're both going to get stuck in the damn hole if I won't go to turn around and we're both down in there. Look, you just stay here. No, I'm not staying here. Yeah, That's you got to stay here, woman. You put a she desk would've... on top of that trap door, you're not getting out. They've <laughs> trapped you in the hole. See, if you go down in the hole first and get stuck, she won't be able to pull you out. So if she goes down in the hole first, you'd be able to pull her out. Monty, I'm she, only a buck 20. She would have said, get down, down, down in that, that no hole, hole, you hole. Get down there, you hole. Get in be there. Be careful going down in that no pipe hole. <laughs> Greg, I was watching the human, human remains of uh, the body. Boy, Robert. Fell. Yeah, Robert and I are on the same wavelength today. Hey, wait, what I was is just he... going to mention that. Say they this, found yeah. Brian Laundry. <sighs> was that confirmed that though? Not him? No, but where? You know, okay, so 
No, they That's found today. his campsite. His belongings, like, I think, too, sorry. were in a backpack. And his parents were spotted there. Yeah. Did he find remains? His, his parents were spotted there, and they're saying that they um, planted evidence of his clothing so that the authorities would find his body because they knew he was dead. And so then the coroner was out there, and they found remains. Wow. So, so he's dead. What, what is that couple? What if that couple person? pissed off the wrong people, and this is all a ruse to cover it all up? Very well, could be something's going on. Yeah, it is a weird thing. You know that girl was involved as a paid actor in 2013 when they had that school shooting. Uh, S H. Yep. Yeah. Oh, oh, what? I didn't I'm know like, all this. Shit. All this is garbage tied to it. This is another ruse. Look over here. Don't pay attention to this. Oh, Come. Lord. Yep. Wow. Right. You're right. Well, and like five other oh, bodies, Amy goodness. says. What? Oh, my goodness. I've been pulled over many times, and I've never been on a cop cam. You know, so that whole thing's weird right off the bat. I don't know how that come about, but, uh, you know. I don't know. That, uh, you mean, okay, that was from someone called... 911 because they saw them arguing or something and that's how that occurred who put it on, who put it on youtube though oh it i don't i would assume it was from the cops but i don't know how uh, it got to youtube yeah that, I don't know. that footage right. wouldn't have been put up on youtube that quick hmm, yeah, I interesting. Up I, that. Yeah. I kind of funny how that. all this is important and on everything and other things you don't even hear that's yeah. right yeah <laughs> yeah. exactly. It's like, it's like it, every whole thing is like a soap opera, you know. All right, so let me explain something to you. <laughs> and I know this for example that my phone that when I got arrested, when they's like, Do you voluntarily hand over your phone or or what? I was like, Yeah, 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 you can have my phone because he's like, Good, because we can get a search warrant for it. I'm like, That's fine, it's right there at my house. So they still have my phone, and it's two years later. So let me just tell you about that. YouTube is not going right. to – someone's not going to just voluntarily put up YouTube a uh, police video of her up on YouTube that quick because under investigation, that shit Evidence. is locked, locked down tighter than, <laughs> than a drum. So I yeah. still have your phone? Yeah. Wow. It's okay. It's got a crack across the screen. I don't want it. <laughs> Yeah. The first time that I saw that was after she was missing. So I'm wondering, is that they're saying the reason why they put it out at that time? Because she's missing at that time. There was some conjecture that she might have been going to come out about the truth of SH. <gasps> oh. And wow. don't talk about that because that will get us taken down quicker than you can. <laughs> Absolutely. Right. Oh, let's oh, talk about it. Goodness. Jeff likes that. Hey, we'll start a new one. I like to start those anyway. Jeff Riddle. Oh, how many years has that been now? And it was December 21st or? 2013. So 2013? 2013. Greg, I figure out a girl name for you. Craig oh, wait a minute. Wait, what is it? When, when was the Craig Boston? Boston? That sounds good. <laughs> when was the Boston... Uh, uh, he party it was back uh, in no. <laughs> pressure, the, the, pressure cook, the pressure cooker event. Oh yeah, those Boston guys. Marathon, lost a marathon, but I don't remember which year. Shit, I don't remember. Was that 2013? <laughs> Thanks, uh, 2013 or 2012. That was that was staged big time too. Uh, well, yeah, because FBI knew about them. Well, you put something in a backpack and you blow it up, and then you're like, "Look, I found a backpack." Yeah, April 15th, 2013. Come on. Okay, so can someone look up the the other event we just mentioned? As to the date, I thought it was really close to Christmas. I hey, thought. Rob. Rob Rubens is in the house. You talking about SH or the pressure cooker? SH. Uh, SH, Connecticut. Hey, I'll get it for you. I think all these dates are. Uh, oh, check this uh, out. Remember that uh, video I played about. Uh, Super Bowl, Jamontria guy, Zach. Yep. Yes. I'm subscribed to him, so I clicked on it and said, uh, 
your kids need to have the vaccine, blah, 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 something, something. So I clicked on it. I'm like, what's up with this dude? But, uh, <coughs> yeah, it wasn't that. It was, it was opposite day. Ah. Pretty interesting. It was right December. on the corner with a sign. Yep. It's pretty December 14th, 2012 was the SH, right? Yep. That's, that's right. And do you know what okay. Newtown is? That town is almost completely, um, the, the population of that town is almost completely made up of uh, employees of the central underscore A. Hmm. Oh, wow. I did not realize yep. that. So almost a of town them. of actors. Yeah, Stephen yeah, King. Yeah, exactly. So check this out. The same people that you've seen on the news as parents and everything else was also seen at the, uh, the Boston thing, too. Yes, you know, I was always wondering, how did they pay off all these people to do this? And now that makes sense. It's a town of the alphabet. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Alex Jones like is a, right, folks. Like a circus community. Mm -hmm. and I swear that Robbie Parker and the guy that supposedly uh, took out George, you know, the, the Floyd guy, are the same person. Remote, remote has brought that to our attention yep. before. Yep. Javin. And, then, and uh, then I know I've seen many photos of children at disaster being carried out of, say, the rubble of something or other. And you go from country to country, it's the same kid with the same uh, actor carrying them. It's just different outfits and different blood places. Like That's that hog boy was involved crazy. in about five of them around Makes here. You wonder what did, was there... Like all the people that died in the Challenger explosion that have been seen again. Yeah, yeah. And and the oh, San in the in the San Diego event. They supposedly have twins. All the astronauts have a twin. Is that not crazy? What are the odds of that, Craig? It's very very slim, sir. Here's one for you, Craig. You know what color that oh, teacher's eyes were? No, what? Which one? They were blue. The teacher on there, they were blue. One blue north and one blue south. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> you know what NASA stands for, Chuck? Need another seven astronauts. You're a smart guy. Yes. You know how many astronauts you can fit in a VW Bug? Eleven. Four in the seats and seven in the ashtray. Ashtray. We used to use that when we were kids. I watched that when I was in grammar school. It was like sixth or seventh grade. And it was on, we watched it live in class. <laughs> it also stands for not a space agency. Yeah. You know, you know what's long and hard, Craig? Uh, ooh, gosh, I'm afraid to answer that question, Jeff. Fifth grade. A uh, Richard. Oh, fifth grade. <laughs> you know what's long and hard and full of semen? Uh, submarine. Submarine. Yes. I was going to say your uh, prison ball, uh, but <laughs> Definitely Monty's prison. Life, fellas. But I love it, you know. Hey, welcome to the Jeff Riddle show. I'm like, who is this nice looking man down in the corner here? He hasn't said a word the Goop entire off. time. Oh, good. I have been very cautious. I don't talk that much. And speaking of which, I had my hand up and I was trying to playing Captain Finger here. I'll just interrupt people here, buddy. Yeah, I know, but <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to be cordial, but hey, know. you know, it's me. Um, but going back to what Chuck was talking about, that dog, uh, uh, the David Hogg person, have you ever compared a picture of him with the 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 um, SH person? Exactly. They're 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 almost twins. I mean, they yeah. are twins. For the uh, same person, maybe. Yeah, absolutely. There is a uh, Colorado event. At one of them, there's several in that state that's happened over the last 30 years. So uh, that 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 same guy was in as a as coming out as a witness. Oh uh, oh oh! What about the guy? That was in, what about the guy that was in the Vegas one? And he said he got shot in the head, and they and he, and the back side of his head was was taken a picture of, and it's a band band aid or whatever over the back side of his hair. No, and just a little blood spot on it. Yeah. I'm sorry, but if you got shot in your head, it's it's gonna uh, do one or two things. <laughs> shopping center shooting in Arizona, and the woman got shot. Her husband's a senator. 
Uh, Heidi. Uh, uh, Gifford, Gifford. 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 It was an yeah. astronaut. Astronaut. One of the yeah. twins. Yeah, and he was dressed up as a Nazi when he was in the Merchant Marines. Oh, I didn't know that group. Scott, That's a good Scott and Jim yeah. Kelly. Hey, uh, I'm going to stop yeah. this. We're going to say a prayer for Cupcake Girl. Her, uh, well, I'll just say the prayer, then you guys will know what's going on. Um, Lord, thank you so much for today. Uh, we just ask you to pray for Cupcake's brother-in-law. I believe he had a stroke and was taken to the ER. We just ask that you reverse all the effects of that stroke and you put a hedge of protection around anyone that has taken the, the uh, Jabberwocky. Um, that it doesn't do anything to them, Lord. And uh, we just ask that you stop this evilness. Um, people are, are getting hurt left and right. And only you can stop this. Or you give us the knowledge and the power to stop this. That's what that's what needs to happen, Lord. Um, cause there's too many people get hurt and, um, uh, we're not going to stand for this anymore. So we're asking for your help, your guidance to end this evilness. Um, there's still too much evil on this earth, Lord. Um, once again, just be with, uh, cupcakes, brother-in-law that he, uh, all, all effects are reversed and it's in your name we pray. Amen. Jesus' Amen. name. Amen. Amen. <clears throat> Robert, what are you doing over there? Yeah, you know, trouble. Bob, bobbing up and down, bobbing up and down. Robert, who do you think you're kidding? We know you're not staying out of trouble. Yeah, I know. <laughs> you're hanging out with us after all. Exactly. Seeing it, that's God reaching his head. <laughs> Look at the windows. Hey, so uh, let's get back to that list. I knew we were going to get off track. You know, I knew we were. There was Sorry. no doubt about it. So I got like sugar, not it's a cool. lot. Sugar, salt. I'm going to well, show you. Salt, but coffee is a good one. Yeah, I'm already starting to box of beans and rice. I got what rice. About, what about what sleeping bags, uh, cooking gear for a campfire, propane cooker? You know, we, we you want to think of yeah. everything. You know where propane I got? For the grill. I got yep. a hint for everything nobody probably thought of. Your water heater holds anywhere from 20 to 50 gallons of water and has a drain on it. If you lose water, you got 20 to 50 gallons you can drain out of that. Correct. Another thing, fill up your bathtubs. That's what we do for hurricane. Yeah. We fill up the bathtubs with water. Then you have a reservoir that you can flush the toilets with in the event that the doesn't work. Hey, uh, yes. Oh, remote's can got I, a tub. Uh, can I say this real quick? No, remote has a tub. <laughs> Whiplash. Biden breaks into strange yelling, mispronounces multiple simple words. So, showing his de his decline even more. The twenty fifth, they, they'll they'll try it, but it'll fail. Yeah. What is that remote? I think Big Mike. Oh, he's muted. He's muted. He must <laughs> think I can read lips. <laughs> This is DMSO. This is what I got from that store called Happy Body. This is what I'm using for detox. Oh, good. Okay. 99% of the human population is deficient in sulfur. Get wow. some of this, folks. I, I'm, I'm, it, the first couple of weeks were tough on it because I was detox and heavy. But I'll tell you, I'm feeling better and better each day using this. And then they also have these creams that are CBD and, and um, one of these has turmeric in it. They're, so that they're DMSO and CBD. Uh, this one has turmeric and this one is DMSO and CBD. Uh, wow, my but skin's improving. I, I just, I can't recommend this company enough, you guys. Turmeric, that is uh, inflammation. Doesn't that take away inflammation? Absolutely. Yeah, and, and, cramps. and pain and tightness, along yeah. with magnesium. Aren't we as deficient in sulfur as we are in borax? Yeah. Yeah, well, I'm using borax now too. Yes. See, I've got I this think huge. We were bag about that here. last night. Yeah, I, I'm with you, Chuck. I do a little sprinkle in my water with the boron. Wife freaked out. You're gonna kill yourself. I said, no, my insides are just gonna be clean. Don't worry about it, woman. Tell her your spot wax in your guts. Yep. <laughs> 
it's I when you a, do large amounts is what microdosing borax. Uh, just I thought it would for the emergency place just because it's powdered soap. That's how so we dry deer think, hide. That's it. They say for, you take a cup of borax, a cup of Epsom salt, and a cup of or a half a cup of Himalayan salt, and fill your I tub think up as that's hot as you can uh, another good thing to have would be and soak in it for as long as you can stay in the water. And yeah, that's that. what I've been doing. I, I'll tell you, it, it helps. It helps de detoxify you. I feel so clean when I get out. <laughs> it feels fresh. Ain't so clean, clean. Exciting. <laughs> it's your soap and your thing. Wash it as long as you want. Or as fast as I want. Either hey, way. Vinegar and water, Jeff. Vinegar and water. <laughs> wax yeah. on, wax off. <laughs> Mr. He's clean, fresh. Mr. Clean. Exciting. It's completely clean and new. <laughs> Look, Marge, I soaked in it. <laughs> fresh, Jeff. Remember that commercial? <laughs> like look Madge like. or Marge or Madge I soaked in it Palm, it's Palm, Palm, Palm Olive <laughs> yeah it's like when Quagmire <laughs> found out there was porn on the internet <laughs> giggity giggity he, he, stayed, he stayed in his oh. house <laughs> one side looked like a spaghetti the other looked like Arnold <laughs> yeah. get a crab yeah. on you gotta switch had, up, buddy. He had a Popeye arm. Buddy <laughs> <switch up. laughs> <laughs> of mine used to joke about it, say he could switch hands and gain a stroke. <laughs> <laughs> for for all you out there, that's a golf terminology. <laughs> <laughs> Four. Depends on how you hold your putter, huh? <laughs> that's right. Putter. Now that's a bogey. <laughs> bogey, eagle, one. what was the hole in one? Bogey. Here, here's some research for your remote. I don't know if you remember. You remember the old uh, the golf game joke thing? It was like a song on one side. My dad had it. It was called the golf game. It was just nothing but a long, dirty joke. It was like from the <laughs> early 60s. I've never heard a dirty joke in my life, Chuck. Me either. My <laughs> Virginia's can take it. <laughs> hey, Craig, back to yes, that te back to that teacher again. Uh oh. You know what the last thing she told her husband was? What? Oh no. You feed the dogs, I'll feed the fish. Oh. Great idea. That's they were thinking ahead. The last yep. thing of our audio was, what's this button for? Oh. What went oh. through her mind? <laughs> Somebody else's ass. Yeah. Oh, that's A lot of things, probably. Yep. Ratings are dropping. <laughs> are they? <laughs> well, they weren't really on that thing anyway. So no. don't even worry, folks. They're still fine. And they've actually found a lot of the challenger people after the fact. One's teaching school somewhere. All yeah, these people politics. that were on there are still alive. Do you know what NASA means in Hebrew? Oh, the devil. Or no, to deceive, to deceive, to deceive. To deceive. Exactly. Yeah. yeah, that's right. Yeah, blue eyes. Yeah. They made such a big deal about that teacher. They were the first civilians to go up and... Oh, yeah. Krista McCullough. Krista McCullough, that was events. it. I remember Hey, before we get before we get off the subject, you know why Bill Cosby went to uh, prison? Anybody? Hold on, I was looking at go trying ahead and to remember. You know what? Why did Bill Cosby go to prison? Why? Why? Pudding for, pops. for pudding. <laughs> putting his dick where it ain't supposed to be. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> Yeah. I thought you meant the prison pudding. pudding. Pretty good pudding. pudding. Everybody loves my pudding pops. That sounds dirty. Prison pudding. Ugh. I'm wondering how he got pudding? out of prison. <laughs> mm. What do you have to do to get out? So good. Yeah. Yep. No, there's a 
the same now. <laughs> what do you guys trust more than uh, Sloppy Joe? What do you guys trust more? Uh, I, I trust licking doorknobs in Wuhan more than I trust Sloppy Joe. So that's kind of the thing where we're going, right? Yeah. Licking the floor in the exam room in the hospital. Yeah. <laughs> Having Bill Cosby mix me drinks. Yeah. I trust that more than Sloppy Joe. Blind chauffeur. Trust in a fart at four o'clock in the morning while you're in bed. After eating Taco Bell. Or, or a box of egg slags. <laughs> having having uh, Casey Anthony watch my kids. Ooh, that's a good, yeah. Cold bird. Watch having Joe Biden watch your yeah, kids. I don't think she did it. Sitting on little Richard's lap. Yeah. <laughs> Having Jeffrey Epstein set up a school trip. Oh, that's, that's one. Uh, I think little Richard was barbecue. more about sitting on the lap. <laughs> yes. <laughs> He'll sit on your lap. <laughs> then uh, Bill Clinton in a box of cigars and in a in a in an in intern. <laughs> <laughs> Having a one-on-one -on -one conversation with Hillary. Yeah. And still being a survivor. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. And tell her you're doorknob proof. Yeah. Last Have time I hung out with Hillary, I laughed my face off. Oh. 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 No. Oh. No. You know, we were right there on the fence, remote, and then he just went, bam, right on the other side. Right on the other side of the fence. Yeah. Yeah. No. I know he just went there. We just turned into a Telegram channel. Have what you flavor, seen that video? Have you seen that video remote? Like a bunch of haters at calling you up and <laughs> a bunch of have, haters now were have you seen joked video about remote? such a thing. Oh my I used goodness. to love the Jeff Riddle show, but I have to leave now. I'm sorry. Well, I, I'd I call her out as I one. as I would like to, but I, I have to do everything in code, you know. So I, I pretended it was funny. Far hey, from it. No. If anyone's yeah. ever even seen a clip of that <laughs> movie, oof. Oh, no, oof. no, no. We... Oh, yeah. Did you guys see what also, Devil Dog yeah. put in there? I was making reference to you make an <laughs> off color joke and people just, you know, they can't take it anymore. Yeah, well, you know what? so sensitive. Yep. Uh, You're just going to have to suck it up. You know, that's how sensitive they are. The other day I wrote an article uh, uh, on this thing about uh, Connor McDavid was whining that he drove hard to the net and he was he was hit and ran into the goalie and that it, it was all bad. And I said, oh, Connor should suck it up. He's playing a physical fast game. And if you're driving to the net, you're not getting a free pass. They didn't like my comment because I said, Connor should suck it up. Oh. <laughs> you can't say anything anymore. Well, you can say you whatever guys, you want on here, buddy. Oh, well, yeah, I know, but I mean. Devil Dog put. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I saw I that. See what Devil Dog said. Say it out there for him, Craig. I don't want to say it. I think he might have been talking about uh, OJ instead of. Uh, yeah, it was OJ who had the bloody thing to wear. OJ wear. instead of uh, Bill Cosby. Yeah. 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 Don't yeah, don't 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 no, nobody can take a joke anymore. It's right. That's yeah. it. Comedy's dead. Yeah, we're bringing it back, Craig. Remember, well, I'm going to create a perfect concept. human. You have to make him every single race. He has to be a bit of every single race. He's got to be gay and a woman. And everybody. Well, he can't be a he. He's got to be a she. Because we and all then, got the joke. <laughs> what people just don't get: we all got the same chromosomes. We're the same race. We're humans. One race, exactly. Yeah. Greg might be a little shy on a couple chromosomes, but other than that, <laughs> we're all good. But <laughs> I, I don't think you can call these people humans that take a little girl's face and cut it off and they wear it as a hawk as a the, the, no, they the, call that. Oh wow, Monty went all in, didn't he, Jeff? Well, mm -hmm. that's what it's about. That's what that joke's about. Right, yeah, yeah that's true. Thing. Thank you, Monty. Wow. <laughs> Wow, their punishment so should be to put up with it puts a lotion on the skin for the rest of their life. Hey, that's what, you know, come, that, come to Monty's channel tonight and say whatever you want. Well, that, that's what I frazzle mean, drip is about. Women, women. We know, well, we know, we know. 
It's disgusting and what put she up did. With off color jokes all our lives. And it's been okay. And we've laughed. But now, you know, then in the workplace, that changed. And uh, then the culture uh, just, I mean, nobody can make a joke now about yeah, anything. I can't, I can't oh, tell my boss to go fly a kite anymore, uh, Shep. I, didn't, nope. I was never offended at uh, anything. I mean, I, I still do it, but you're not supposed to. You could get rolled up or... or you, you should can? buy him a oh, kite. Oh, my goodness. You mm-hmm. should give him a kite. Buy him a kite as a present. Oh, yeah. yeah, you should. <laughs> that would be a way of telling him, by. but not telling him. TT's in the house. TT! TT! Oh, tactical Hey, guys. My lover. internet's cutting in and out, so I'm going to go and watch in the chat, maybe listen in. And you know, I'm signing out to go to the chat. Um, right, I know, I'm getting out of here too. Love you, Goob. Love you guys. I'm out too. Bye. I'm out too. Yeah, see you Love later. You. Bye. Adios. <laughs> Adios. I'm watching. Oh, I want to watch a portion with my wife. We get to spend yeah, time, time. My together, camera so. died, so I'm really up here for nothing. So, we all can keep Chuck. All right. Love y'all. Love you. See ya. <laughs> see you later, Craig. So, anything going to happen tonight, Jeff? What's tonight, Robert? Wednesday? I don't know. Something's going to happen. Probably going to get yelled at at work, probably. That's probably going to happen. I'm just kidding. Why? Oh, I I was going to say why. No. They try to, but I just yell back, and then they don't (laughs) want to talk to me, so it's perfect. Awesome. Yeah. Wednesday stopped being hump day for me a long time ago. I, I haven't been working since 2016. Well, that's good and bad, I guess. Yeah. They're, oh. they're afraid of my daughter. They won't come talk to her because they were afraid of her. Yeah, she speaks. Yeah, she speaks her mind. She's very blunt. It's good, Diamond. Mm. Yep. Don't mess with the Diamond Lil family. <laughs> I just don't understand how some people know the plan and we don't know the plan and they say everything's going to be all right, but it's not. Everybody's dying. Not everybody, Robert. <clears throat> We's alive and well. Yeah. We're going to make it through. Um, it's like Mad Max, you know. Like, oh, well, like it might be a little crappy on the other side, but make it your way, I guess. After after all, everything's screwed up. Yeah. Maybe that's what they're trying to do. They're it's like the military. They got to break you down, then they got to build you up the right way. Maybe that's what I think. That's what they're trying to do with us. They're trying to collapse everything <clears throat> with our. Uh, well, with everything, economy. It's so bad up. as it is right now. I don't know what's it, what's the uh, hold up. Oh, it's it's gonna get way worse, Robert. Way worse. Lively prepper. It could be a whole year. Yeah. Laughter is good medicine, they say. It is. Yeah. I've been, I haven't been in the doctor in, in probably a couple, three decades. I laugh every day. There you go. Yeah. I'm laughed. not ever going to see a doctor again. I don't care what happens. No. No. I, I, look, you guys all know that. I broke that little pinky there, and I just yeah. said, I ain't going. They're going to do the same thing I just did. It saved me a bunch of money, and I didn't have to deal with all those morons. Well, I thought that was just a style statement. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, buddy. That's how me and Craig, you know. Hey. Hello, TT. TT. I don't understand. <laughs> the EBS, is that power supposed to go out or is it going to go out? I don't know, Robert. I don't know. <sighs> yeah. You know, Robert. Oh, go ahead, Jeff. Oh no, I no, I'm good. I'm done. Oh, 
I was just going to say, Robert, um, there's only like, or they say there's only like 10 people that know the plan and they're not going to tell us the plan because if they <coughs> tell us, the other people will know the plan. Robert, so if they know the plan, you yeah. tell everybody. Right. So how much more suffering do we have to have? A lot. Robert, we haven't suffered near enough. Look how much fun we're having. Robert, <laughs> Robert, this has got to be. This has got, this has got to to be to where everybody in the United States feels this and never ever wants to let it ever happen again. Plain and simple, and it's just like an analogy I used on Travis's the other night, a couple, about four or five nights ago. If you're uh, if you're real, if you're playing a game of chess and you're playing the top-notch chess player, genius, you know you don't you don't let them know all your moves ahead of time because it only takes one or two moves and you've lost the game from the very get-go. We've and only got one shot. We've only got one shot at this. If not, America falls completely. And look at how things get misconstrued too. You, they might tell you one thing, and then you tell somebody else, but they mis, you know, construe it and talk it about something that you didn't even say. Yeah, maybe, <clears throat> uh, if I'm on, I don't know if I'm gonna be on tomorrow. I might be on tomorrow. I don't know, but maybe we should do that. Like I tell Robert something, then he tells someone else something. All on here. Mm -hmm. I bet you it's different, even on here. By the time yeah. you get to the last person. Yeah, we could do that too by everybody else muting and you talking to Robert. Yep. And then, yeah, except panel, for if anybody is, yep. yeah, if anybody is uh, a lip reader. Yeah, that would be. Do you ever get that $100 from Jeff? No. Okay. You're not going to neither, Robert. Do you think, Mr. T, how he said every lie is going to be revealed? Is that going to happen, do you think? You better not have told no lies lately, Robert. You know, it's it's like I was on Travis's last night. Jeff B was on there, and he was talking about, you know, how they troll him in the chat. And I got on, and I said, you know, they these people either like what you're saying, or if they don't like it, instead of arguing you with you in the chat, they can always go off to another chat room. And I said that happened to me with somebody um you know i didn't like sometimes the way they were and i you know this person would say if you don't like it get the f out and i did i got out now i check in every once in a while with that person i'm not bad mouthing or anything like that that's not what i'm trying to do my point was that you have choices as a person and instead of sitting in chat behind your keyboard you know calling that person all kinds of names and stirring the pot, just jump out. Don't stay, you know, get jump out. Jump out or join the chat and, and, and be respectful when you challenge right. somebody. Right. And if you can't get out, that was my point. And, you know, I think some people took it as, you know, like, a, you know, I had some people say, yes, this person is, is rude and stuff like that. And, you know, it, it's all in your perception, but I wasn't bad mouthing the person per se. I was just saying my point was that you don't have to, if you don't like it, just go to another channel. Don't watch that one. You know, you have a choice. If you don't have anything nice to say, try right. not to say it. it yeah. I know it's hard sometimes, and I have yeah. that problem. Yep. It's hard to bite my tongue. Just go to some other chat if you don't like it. Or someone mentioned on my show last night that uh, don't invite someone up there for their information and everything else and then tell them to uh, be quiet yeah. and to. Or you're a liar. You know, we want to see proof. Where's your proof? You know, you're just, it's awful. Go find your own sauce. Go do some research for a chain and, and change instead of me doing it for you, Skippy. That's exactly. what I tell them now. No, exactly. <laughs> Carrie, said, Carrie said the body of that was Brian Laundry. Yep. We'll so it is his. Yep. Uh, yeah, you know, I don't. 
I don't really get offended by too much. You really got to upset me quite a bit to, to get me going. I just play yeah. along and I'll, I'll give it back to you. So um, no big deal. But yeah, Robert, look, it, what's going to happen when you ain't going to see us every day? You got to start getting strong mentally up here. Uh oh. Maybe we'll go through some training exercises for you tomorrow. Yeah. Get, you, uh -oh. get you mentally strong. What you got, Monty? Remote. Yes, sir. Uh, uh huh. Oh, uh, I'll have to look it up. You don't have it. Uh, get Mo TV. Just massive dump of Pizza Gate and Pedo Gate. It's on. It's uh, uh. It says Veer Beware. It's on Bit Shoot. What's it? See, what's it called? Rebel, you know it. They're dropping. They're dropping what's, stuff. I'm telling you all week. Get Mo dump Channel of, or something. Uh, that's on Telegram, but it's on Bit Shoot. Uh, what's the name on Bit Shoot so I can look it up? Hang on. Uh. Hang on. You want? Let me click on it, and let me see. Wow! Oh my goodness! Oh my, dude, people, there's 43 videos that just got dropped of this. Monty, I okay. love how you keep us waiting. I, I just can't on. wait. I'm trying, I'm trying to find the <laughs> thing. Come on, hurry up. Come on, Monty. To I got to know Monty. this Monty, come on, Monty. Snap <laughs> out of it, lad. <laughs> there's, oh, there's, so many. Focus. there's so many. There's so many. Holy cow. Okay, hang on. I'm uh, just mugging you too, bud. Which, which one do you want? <laughs> That's all one, uh, Tell 40. me the name of the channel. It's uh, called Gitmo TV. It's on Telegram. Okay. Oh, you already told us that 15 minutes ago. Sorry, buddy. Yeah. We weren't yeah, on to... Telegram. <laughs> I know. I got bit shoot, so I'll try Gitmo on there, though. What Hang is on. it, Gitmo TV? Yeah. On, on, on Telegram? Yeah, it, it's the latest one. 43 videos of all this. All right, let me let me get on that real quick. We're going to wrap this up here in a minute because I got to go. I got to go be yeah, a slave. Yeah. Yeah. There's perk. Call, uh, pervy wood, there's frazzle drip, burnt pizza. Oh my goodness, a bunch! All right, uh, yeah, I can I don't screenshot. Know if I want to watch those. Though. I can screenshot this so you can type them in remote, I guess. Wow. Uh, okay. Well, you know what? I got buds who send me Telegram and stuff. Like my brother and my friend send Mary, they send remote. me the Telegram videos that I can open all the time. So they'll they're probably already all over it. So don't worry all about right. it. I'll get it here soon enough. Yeah, there's. There's YouTube ones and bit shoots. Oh my goodness. Yeah, so those YouTube this message ones cannot be, be on. displayed on Telegram apps. Yeah. because uh, you're on the you're on the Google Play Store yep. app. You gotta go in through and do the online one like I did. It takes up less memory too on your phone. How do I do that? <clears throat> go in. Oh, how did talk how did talk tell me? You gotta go in through the Telegram site, download it. To the to the AFK file, the APK file, and then I forgot the steps. I, I got all night to figure it out. I, I have to get. I have to ask Hawk again because uh, he told me during the forty eight hour prayathon, and I went right in, and it wasn't real hard. I just forgot the actual steps. Uh, Looks like uh, fifty six thousand. 56,000.4. Get more TV. So here's here's a number for you, remote. Uh, it's on BitChute. H U Y D K 9. Just wait, wait, wait. I Because I got out of there. Just said. Oh. Say again. Okay, it's H U Y D K nine W I T B J E W I T E J E T B as in uh boy okay. J E Okay Thank you sir you're a good man Chuck Brown Okay, I'm getting the fall of the cabal. 
doctors around the world issue dire warning. All this stuff's is old, 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 old. Well, some of them, some of them are. Uh, but this one was called the Franklin Cover Up Pedophiles in Washington, D.C. Oh, I've seen that. Uh, that's a really good thing if you can stomach that filth. Um, well, that's, yeah, I don't, I'm not. Right. No, I was just saying. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Yeah, there's, there's just a bunch of them that, that just. All I know is one day I want to give Dr. Judy Mikovic the biggest hug ever. I just have one bit, one piece of information from the um, John Solomon. I don't know if you guys have heard of him. Heard of him? He's kind of an investigative reporter, and uh, he reported that the uh, FBI, the the F underscore I agents, visited that Russian billionaire Oleg uh, Deripaski uh, in the summer of 2016 to work with them in setting up the future president. Sounds good. You guys haven't seen the info about the Hydra. This is very good. I posted in both. You muted yourself remote. If you guys haven't Take seen uh, Dr. Kerry Madey on the Hydra, I've yeah. posted it in both chats. I think it's very important that you know that and uh, show that to people that are considering going out to get the roll up your sleever. That will that will stop everyone in their tracks. Just saying. All right. Well, I'm gonna get off here and get to work. Have Love a you, safe Jeff. night, Jeff. Yep. Oh, yeah. Yep, I'll be hiding out. Well, so, go ahead, buddy. It's saying uh, on another site, five E6Bs are airborne right now. And that's the doomsday planes. Five of them? I don't have yeah. enough silver yet. Is the whole continuity of government <laughs> up in the air right now? Uh <laughs> thinking because right above it there's a whole bunch of stuff going on huh yeah and jeff you you still have to view that video from earlier today that craig did on uh for uh in tribute to you on craig's channel yes yeah i'll i'll listen to it on the way to work jeff's life theme we've got a theme song oh, that yeah. just explains your life it's going to be good I'll have too much fun. <laughs> Love you all. Have a wonderful day. You too. We'll May see God you later. May God bless you all and keep you until we meet again. In the name of Jesus Christ, amen. Amen. Thank you. Yeah, take your mask off. Shut the news off. Love each other. Help each other out. Don't consent. Love your neighbor. Stock up for your neighbor. Yeah, stock up for your neighbor. That's a good one. Yeah. Take your vitamins. Sorry, but my neighbor's on their own. I got the drug dealer and the asshole. <coughs> there you go. All right. I'm going to watch my theme to my life. <laughs> <laughs> All right. See you guys in a little bit, I'm sure. All right. Later. Love you all. Love you. Yep. Drive Love safe, you. Jeff.